you can grab pretty much any radio um, as long as it's a kind of a beefy size one and hack it into a guitar amp um, you know you might ask why you want to do this you just use guitar amp well you get some awesome lo-fi sounds coming out of this thing um, and I've made a few of these now and you can do it quite basically you could just add a jack and you look out to the, uh, the volume switch and away you go the sound is so so there's a fair bit of feedback that comes through but it's a very grungy, dirty sound. This time around, I decided to add a few filters in the way of caps, um, and it's really cleaned the sound up. The sound on this thing is, is awesome, actually. Um, the radio still works as well, so you don't wreck the radio, but you can now, you've actually just converted over to, to an amp, and so you can use it as an amp as well. Uh, I've also added a switch here. This allows you to convert back to, or remove some of the filters, so it gives you more of a, um, an overdrive sound to it. I'll play my guitar, you can have a listen. I'm a terrible guitarist, fair warning, but I'll just give you an example of what it sounds like, and uh, yeah, you can uh, hear for yourself. The, um, the mod and the hack is actually, there's an Instructables for it, so just check out the link in the YouTube clip. Um, there'll be an Instructables page. I'll flash up now what the um, circuit is very basic check it out yes yeah, so that's the circuit it's uh, like I said it's easy um, it's a lot of fun and yeah let's get it going alrighty so I've got the axe and I'll um, I'll play a few tunes and you can hear what this thing sounds like so you probably can't see it from there, but there is a treble and a bass controller here, or pot. So it really, it's pretty cool. Um, if I was gonna build, build one of these, um, always try and find, um, at least to have a tone on it. This one's got both bass and treble, which is great. This allows me to change the, chain, change the sound a little bit. Um, it's off now. So we'll just turn it down a bit. Um, I'll play a little bit of a tune and then you can hear what it sounds like uh, and then I'll flick it over to overdrive and you can hear the beefy sound. What that does is it just um, turns off a couple of the filters, the cap, a couple of the caps and gives it more of a, a dirty low down um, sound, it's pretty cool. Alright, so. Um, a nice little feel to it. I'll turn up the, the bass a bit and put it on the treble and hear what it sounds like now. Um. sounds pretty cool. Uh, so now what we'll do is we'll flick it over to overdrive. Um, turn it up a bit. Pretty cool. What we'll do though is we'll just turn the bass up from the treble midway. You can hear it's a lot. 
lot more dirtier. I like it, that sounds pretty cool. So anyhow, that's probably enough. Um, I'm sure, hopefully your ears aren't bleeding. Um, I'm not the best guitarist in the world, but I have a lot of fun with this thing. As I mentioned, the radio still works, so you can still listen to your tunes through it. Um, it's a pretty simple hack. Uh, get onto it. If you've got some of these, usually you can find something like this around. I found this one down the tip uh, or the dump, picked up for free, so that was pretty cool. Already had batteries in it and everything. But you can, I'm sure you've got to find something like this around, you know, a relative's house. You might even have one lying around. Um, yeah, that's it. Check it out and have fun. Cheers.